Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is gonna be a cash stuffing envelope. No. Hey guys. Hey guys, welcome back to my Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a cash stuffing envelope and this is freaking Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is gonna be a cash stuffing envelope and this is for the July 1st paycheck. Um I'm just gonna zoom you guys in. Well, yeah. So I'm gonna put the money. On the side. They gave me quickly dollars. Okay. Um, let me. Okay, so I allocated $50 for gas. And then I should have, let's see. I have 111, so I added, and then I'll say July 1st. $50, um, I took away, I think I used to allocate 55, but I just, we have a lot left over, so I decided to do 50. I know my husband's starting to do Uber on Saturday night, so I don't know, we'll see. We might need to increase that, but we, we he's, he did it last week, so I don't know for how long. 5, 11, not plus 50 equals 161. Is 161. So that's 50, 100, 150, 160, and 101. Okay. So that one's good. And then for my kids' um, chore money is $40. And that one I did 120 and two tens. Twenty, thirty, forty. Kids' money. Um, I have money left over, and I have ten dollars. So I'm gonna put forty. Twenty, thirty, forty. So I have a total of fifty. Okay. The next one is haircut, which is $20. And that, I just put a $20. We still have some money in there. Um, I don't think I'm gonna add any more. So $20. So that should give me sixty-three dollars. So twenty, forty, sixty-three. I think that's enough, even for my eyebrows, and then my husband's and my little son's, my youngest haircut. So I don't think I'll put any more money for haircut. Now for my Chris, now for Christmas, these are my sinking funds. It's forty-two dollars. I want to get to at least two thousand by, I believe it was Black Friday or the first week of December. I'm not sure. I usually like to do some Christmas shopping on Black Friday, depending on what my kids, you know, I don't know, depending on the sales as well. That way. Um, I currently have $1,134, so, and I haven't used anything. So I think I'm on $42. 
to. So I think I'm on schedule. I know I allocated at least $42 for every paycheck and that should be get me to the 2000 so. And I started this, I believe it was either the last week of December or in December. I'm not sure when I started this, but or January, I'm not sure, but okay. And then for back to school fun, for the best, for the back to school fund is forty-seven dollars. That's twenty, forty. 46 and 47 and for back to school it was 600 normally but then I remembered school fees so the 600 was only going to be for back to school shopping like a pair of shoes and like a couple of outfits pants or, or shirts but since I forgot back to school fees and I'm mostly worried about my two older kids since one's going into high school and then the other one's ninth grade into junior high so their fees are a little pricey so I don't know how much that's gonna be but that way I was like uh, whatever money's left over can be for the fees and then and then if there's any money left over then I can add it to their school lunch so Um, I know I'll probably start using this and start buying some of their at least shirts or just to get it started. So 538 plus 47 is 585. And I think what I'm going to do is change some of these smaller bills to bigger bills. Way it's not so chunky okay and then what's next is my husband's allowance and my allowance is $20 each so I'll just put these aside and then for family fun is $50 and I believe I haven't used up any of it so I should have 108, so 50, 100, yep, 108, and then we're going to add 50, so that's 158, and this is probably going to go to use up not to waste use i would say waste birthday is twenty dollars um my birthday will be next week and let's see after that i have my dad's birthday in august so just gonna keep adding it until but i think it should be good let's see add So I have 96 right now. It's 116 I should have. So there's 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, and 10, 15, 16. Okay, 116. And then for holiday is $40, 20, 40, um, where's my holiday? It's right here. For holiday, I have $66 and that's for, I used it up for Father's Day and so, for this, it's going to be 
for July 4th. We'll probably buy some fireworks since we're not gonna go anywhere or even maybe use it to buy some good steak and just smoke it outside, something, I don't know. Plus $40, it's 166 plus 40 is 100 six dollars so I have 20 40 60 80 85 90 95 100 and one two three four five six 106 okay and then Car maintenance is $10. And then for car maintenance, I've used some of it for my tags. I used 143 for my car tags. Um, I also changed the oil, but that was included in the plan, I believe. My husband gets like some plan that you pay something and it covers like certain amount of oil changes and stuff like that. So, so 522 plus 10 is 532. And I know next month, no, in August, my husband's tax will be up and then that is it. And I think my car, I don't know. I need a tune up, I don't know, we'll see. Okay. And that is it for that video. Okay, so for I took out $359 for my cash envelopes and sinking funds this check. Um, so this is it for this video, this really short, simple video. But if you have any questions, comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.